for this office when you're Maybe you shouldn't start while one of the judges is standing up. I Perhaps. I the actual <laughs> 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 Let's pull this out at Blood Brooks in like three times. Okay. Um, the old Chris Wright special. Yeah. Is anyone not ready? Cool. Ethics starts from the obligations of the other, this demands a creation, maintains the community as a depression of our obligations. The other first moral agency begins with social spices and structures, gives us the values that guide us, the language we use, the reason, the characteristics that help create us as a personal identity are influenced by history that precedes the social norms that influence how we see ourselves, sexual partners. So, what we should do because the other laws that exist with our identity. Second, the only reason ethical questions are asked because of concern for the other, otherwise, we act self because we have no care about how our actions impact others. Third, the language of the end of the the resolution question to the democracy is presupposed in the question, this presupposed to the who we are, who, uh, whom we are dependent on, invested in the end, exclusion and everyone with no idea world three. Warns first that we the in the United States, excluded by the market population within outside of the democracy move to K and states there is a people who are excluded among the states that have not demarcation between those who belong and those outside the democracy consists of the identity between rules and rules and rules necessary to children who belong to the democracy and apply culture required by constitution people the democracy always in its exclusion. Second, suffrage are inherently construed through the differentiation from others but when I too the suffrage is constitu uh, constitu uh, constituted through exclusion until by autonomy through differentiation that distinguishes the point the suffrage is not the claim it's determined constitute the character it's a precondition of A to Z. However, we cannot eliminate the possibility of an antagonism without eliminating difference in the possibility of the collective identities that form the base of politics itself. Hagland, absolute peace is separate from absolute violence anything that within violence without the possibility of life absolute peace, only the undesirable future that uh, conditions where anything happened. Therefore, the correct ethical theory also recognizes that inevitable potential for antagonism while recognizing that the pendulum of our theory requires ethical thought in the first place. The solution is a channel of possibility of a destructive antagonism and a productive agonist relationship between politics as uh, does not attempt to destroy the other but treat them as legitimate adversaries. Move. Politics in the case practically which see the organized human existence and conditions always come because they are affected by the political. This is not how the right of consensus without exclusion. Democratic politics, uh, democratic politics without overcoming opposition crucial is to establish discrimination how with pluralist democracy agents and pluralism is the dumb that is no longer perceived as an enemy, but someone who's uh, somebody whose ideas will come out, but whose right to defend ideas we do not question. We have a shared adhesion to liberal democracy. Thus, the standard rule allows the consistency with the agonistic democracy. In fact, US and base evaluation is irrelevant. Our friendly argues the question of how politics should be organized and the consequences of politics. Prefer additionally, first of all, in fact, morally we need to know what is right, which part is agonistic questioning of our beliefs. Either a and the conflict causes the change of what's correct, which shows that is key to either a moral error and act correctly, or B, moral beliefs remain the same, which means our beliefs are strong against criticism. That's true. Second, that's my friend will continue to its authority because we recognize the value of different perspectives. Third, not recognizing the contingent nature of ideas reinforces hegemon power structures. Move. Consensus is which be a frontier between what is and what is not legitimate is political and it should remain contestable to the like culture of the present the former frontier is rationality to naturally what should be a condition hegemonic articulation of the people who resolves to reify the identity of the people by reducing it to one of its main forms. Fourth, value to life and our life is valuable because we have interactions with others. Agonists and contestations are prerequisite to the process of making relationships that shape us and give us our opportunity to change and be changed, closing us off results in a meaningless existence with no ability to engage the outside world. Fifth, every act has a potential to be excluded because there's no assured way, uh, way to determine actions affecting other frameworks full fail since they fail to recognize self created exclusion this justifies an agonism because it recognizes the plurality of views instead of giving more Dental an uh, answer, part two is offense. Currently, judicial candidates undergo an election on all as a review of political affiliation or how they would vote in case of well in office ABA 14. A judicial candidate shall not publicly identify as a candidate of a political organization or connection with cases and make pledges or commitments. Advocacy. Those I advocate that in the United States voters' rights and no law to be valued above judicial right, the can uh, right, a candidate rights to privacy regarding party affiliation within judicial elections. Check our answer in CX to avoid unnecessary theory based Bray law with three brackets of original evidence. The country benefits of the president election while judicial election campaigns are seemingly ideals of stability. Judges are not apart from voters. They, uh, they, uh, judges are selected directly by the public. They serve judges. They are in Influenced by their own political viewpoints in a democratic political system, will voters are entitled to select those who make law and partisan elections are an instance of the re uh, resolution. Freeze mail nine. A questionnaire asks judges political philosophy candidates refuse to answer no candidates forced to respond to any such question <coughs> by the groups that prepare these questionnaires can already have a right to know where judges stand. This is a democratic way. Now, affirm first under agonism non partisanship is meant you are always, but you are always partisan, such an age of violence. Those who attempt to be non partisan inevitably fail or partisan sense exclusion and difference is inevitable. The attempt to be non partisan ignores the institution of exclusion and allows the defense results only further exclusion. Second partisan election are key to questions about an agonistic process that orients our partisanship against antagonism. Move Five. Social ultras claim we have an interest in which partisan conflicts are of the past. The notion of partisan free demor democracy partake of the anti political vision which refuses to acknowledge the antagonistic dimension of the political, uh, such long exacerbating antagonistic potential in society. Obviously, certain politics in terms of consensus is based on, uh, based on false premises and those who share social vision are bound to miss the real task. Third, non partisan elections are, are spaces of non participation since people don't participate in non partisan elections. Partisan elections are key to participation. No disadvantage of partisan elections. Lack of political affiliation information only causes fewer people to participate. Vote 018. Partisan system transfers decision making power from state to vote uh, to vote in the commission or potential minority judge judges are selected by a commission of, and uh, voters are asked to represent twice the chance meetings are closed to uh, partisan judicial elections and for voters ideology shape not to see the law. The way to create this info is through publicizing party affiliation. This is the most important fact for voters info about party affiliation as important consequence. There's is higher voter participation of partisan <coughs> elections and nonpartisan election states get no benefits. Fourth, nonpartisan elections keep incumbents in the stuff intelligence. Ninety nine percent of the comments are reelected in nonpartisan elections, but all three. Retention elections don't allow the public to cast in a form of because the judge is not identified by party absence or party identification and is more striking than another. But elections voters choose to incumbents even in the absence of active campaign saying killing these in this context less than one percent of judges. For retention elections have been removed, we count as a real loss of public debate. Underview. 
First of all, F5 will F5 win counter interpretation. A point Aflex then has the ability to win on either way. So the Athens is standing ability in the two air. The two air is too short to land neutral. Play deep against the two in our period argument. So the Athens receivable layers rather than adding more unreceivable avenues. That's all a problem. A problem is the long two in our people rest across the only thing that can reach because only the Athens has a burden to be top of the list. The Athens are already at the compensation for the next unique avenue to, uh, avenue to the ballot. Second, F gets one in theory and meta theory. Determined from being infinitely abusive. Otherwise, they'll always win meta theory. Ensures I can engage in theory and not lose on the highest cover. Layer. Third, prefer Athens and Mantle. Third, team was AC. We always find a way through bidirectional team. That theory offers move. We should just debate the Athens, even if it means generic sense of. F is, F is structurally behind to uh, structurally behind to the time skew. Uh, next is uh, next on truth testing. First is policy making comparative worlds to be the best for policy making. These the F is forced to depend on the world. Next has to show what the status quo is or compare the worlds better. This force comparison as opposed to truth testing, which size size policies making by making implementation or level or biophysics like step set and rest of processing our balance compared to the worlds result in warfare. Debates by uh, removing structurally unfair arguments like skip and the absurd result of the truth testing just by the running chief trial arguments like a priori, which makes the debate irresolvable. These both sides can win their own separate truth testing argument without it being impossibly, uh, possibly clear. This always generic sense like fairness because that way that makes the judge's job of adjudicating the debate impossible. Fourth, truth testing is an aim for absolute truth that violence having causes absolute violence. Fifth means that we can't perhaps we can't you out on things like racism, which we say exclusion next. The app employs scenario analysis at heuristic. This is pedagogical value and helps crystallize information and enhances ability to break out status quo perception. Catcher 98. Scenarios are not predictions. Scenarios perceive futures in the present through creation of pathways, complexity of uncertainties, reducing and incorporating anything in forecast fails, changes of current scenarios, assume their futures, and moving targets, scenario method, aim of perceiving connections, and enhancing their ability to gain insights through uh, reperception. Break right across. All right, at the top of the app, the three point, what is this definition of democracy? What do you mean, what is this definition of democracy? Yeah, so what's oh, the, the, the move card? No, 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 the three point under like the first part of your framework. What right, the argument is that if you say in a democracy something ought to happen, then that necessitates a democracy, which is a community of people that come together and create decisions by electing people in the first place. Okay, so it's only a justification for your framework. Uh, it's like an agent spec justification, but yeah. absent the standard, is this a reason to affirm like without any other like framework in the ground? Are you asking if it's a priori? Yes. No. Okay. Great. Um, <coughs> on the authors, do you defend uh, federal judges or state judges? Uh, we indicate that the affirmative like. Uh, the affirmative should happen. We say in the United States someone ought to happen. Uh, we do not specify a like person that does it, but we will spec if you want. Okay, what's the warrant for prefer app on semantical interps? Uh, the warrant for prefer app on semantical interps is that there's always bi-directional T. For example, you can read shows like, you must implement, you can't implement, which means that the semantics offense is basically new because there's semantical offense going both ways, which means that we should just, uh, w there's also pragmatic offense on bi-directionality under those semantical interpretations, which means Wait, that so even if- we win, If we're winning independent pragmatic offense, is that sufficient to like negate on a shell? No, because there's offense going both ways. For example, you could say like, there's an independent voter under you can't implement. Wait, wait, there's so also the argument, independent voter the under argument you must you're making is that because there are arguments for both debaters, we can't vote on T. Uh, the ar it's not that there are arguments for both debaters, rather it's that there is the existence of bidirectional topicality, which means that you can't vote on T. Okay. Is there anything in the affirmative framework that could trigger permissibility? Uh, no. Okay, so in the 1AR or the 2AR, you are not going to stand up and say, because of an argument that I made, like, a, that, like we cannot buy, like, like bind action. Uh, like, I can go for you cannot find action, but I'm not going to go for that triggers permissibility. Okay. Like there are other implications for that besides permissibility. Okay. Like I, I will say I'm not going for presumption of permissibility, but like Okay, yeah. cool. Um on your which part is it? On the like five points to prefer. Yeah. Or uh, okay, so your standard of consistency with an agonistic democracy. How do we determine if our actions are consistent with an agonistic democracy? Uh, by weighing them under the standard. Yeah. So what does that look like? So for example, we would say like if you help increase agonism by breaking down something like a myth of nonpartisanship, which our haggling card specifically indicates. So it depends on the, the consequences causes. of our actions on. Agonism. No, the argument is that here is a political structure. The <coughs> best, the person that best like structures this political structure is the one that should win. It's not about the consequence of creating that structure, rather it is about how that structure affirms or negates under the framework okay, itself. Okay, so then how do we determine who is best like structuring that structure? For, that okay, sense? so it's like this. If I have a blueprint and I say this blueprint is the standard, then whoever meets the standard would be the one that constructs the building most close to the blueprint. It's not about like, is your building like consequential or something, it's just about constructing a building close to the blueprint.
Alright, 302 left, the order will be 4 off the base. I send the doc, tell me when you guys are ready. Is it cool if I borrow your stand? Yeah, sure. I yes. You're also just as tall as me, so I don't need to deal with the problems like that. You just have to be like lower the stand each time. Okay, uh, I just saw my just kind of. Yep. Anybody not good? Interpretation of the affirmative debater must not read an advocate to advocate to the parameters of the resolution to clarify the affirmative debater must not specify which get it from public, public offices plan affects and deals with the uh, type of information to the app uh, is uh, disclosed via a violation you read a plan. This specifies which candidates are for public offices and a type of info that the public has a right to know standard ones. Limits must find candidates allows her millions of permutation and absence candidates one for different positions. I president, governor, senate, uh, house of representatives, uh, etc. Combatant with info means you can spec literally one governor in Nebraska's political affiliation impacts eight point fantasies. Good holds a negative into gener generics like the condensate every single time they exist because it happens. Because they know the one and see will be literally every single time, and also because I never get to debate you till debate, even if it's my, even if it's my best layer people in it. Because I guess you can make sure every round can be about the topic, even if the neck doesn't have specific effect to the opposite area. See, from the source of proxy there, interpret requires a neck to work for the perfect team. Has the apple, the apple, because I'm just one that needs a one and see. We'll get to show about one air front lines in every debate since he happens at least 30 times more private on my end. Interpret make sure the research burden judge around all receivable lines with the sense of both the bit is after. Probably the topic due to the voters' bottom pair of the bit is a competitive activity that requires objective evaluation and always other voters and error ability in which we'll always get IE educated from other rounds. We will never get a level playing field without theory of the the abuse has already occurred in my time allocation and shift also the shell is your whole object of seven which is which is my I use committee in terms of two already said the top since we figure out the best possible no minute voice judge intervention sensor a career clear about that no our various apron is made though just be a theory probably just by saying that abuse and results in a chilling effect we found it's not logical you don't reward them for meeting the burden of being fair especially on a TW or definition or objectively you read to be certain actual logic is medical channel on all arguments because it definitely determines whether an argument is valid second off. Permissibility and presumption negate both the resolution and indicates the affirmative has to have proven obligation and permissibility would deny the existence of, uh, the existence of an obligation be point. Say it's more often false than true because any part can be false. This means you negate if there's no offense because the resolution is probably false. Any moral evaluation presupposes the unconditional worth of humanity that means treating others as ends in themselves. Commerce guard 83 bracket for your gendered language. So when a rational being makes a choice, they suppose that it, it, uh, it's for to be justified. There must be something that is unconditionally good and cannot be the incl uh, inclination nor can it be external things. The unconditionally valuable thing must be rational in nature. We must regard ourselves as capable of conferring valuable. Objects we must rather, but we must regard others as capable of value by rational choices as ends in, 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 in themselves. It's always a one all other frameworks collapse non Kantian theories by the source obligation in, in extrinsically good objects. But that presupposes the goodness of the rational will be point necessity by frame because inherent the, the way we set ends ethics must be necessary and not conditions. Otherwise, this claim could be as capable of necessary to that way or probability of a necessary to the probable that means it's in a possible world, but it implies that it's uh, true in all words. That's what necessity is. So they have to prove that is it zero risk of my frame again. Any non universal norm justifies someone's ability to be an impede on your ends, which also means universal. Universalizability acts as a second train on all other frameworks here in 99. When I represent my end, I represent it as binding me to certain courses of action. Those plans determine what I can do in representing an end. I demand recognition from a forward from other subjects. Since the end is as an object for me, I cannot be independent of I committed to realizing my end. I must determine the wisdom I be recognized. I recognize the other two points. Ethical frameworks must be theoretically legitimate. All frameworks are frontally topic on the arguments of the word odds. So they must be theoretically justified for proper research. Resorts disparity to focus on evidence and statistics. It is rewards. Do it with the most pre-run prep, which increases the disparity between. Moles and big souls with huge evidence about the content to be resolved because it can easily be won without any perhaps sense only and a little arguments are required. This also means you to prefer content because they don't emphasize you from empirical topic literature. You can defend a sense that equalizes the playing field and uh, cut the people in the end. Thus, the standard is consistent with treating people with ends uh, like uh, as ends in themselves prefer impact, uh, the impact calculus. Uh, uh, 
of violating someone's freedom does not respect others as ends and is held in a not universal law's ability because of in violating of violating someone's freedom you just avoid that someone to violate your freedom simultaneously which would result in a contradiction one point violation of privacy or a contradiction in conception since their action is not one along with respecting others as ends in themselves coming of 14 for a world to be created uh, is for it to be physically and psychologically unfortunate and its operation the ability to be in the public or private space without having actions monitored by others contributed to the, the development of uh, exercise of freedom by its or privacy violation for so will in its operation process of rise of the or more reason for these violations of the inner autonomy and freedom and consequently a capacity for more reason called the other arguments third off. Go to the second card of transparency leads to scandals that are spun in partisan ways. Miller 16. Clinton took inadequate steps to protect more than even to Comey's transparency as a gift to Trump and the Republicans as a reason to a life and a life into an issue that Trump supporters have been totally to keep from understanding the transparency provided by the access Hollywood tapes were a gift to Clinton and the Democrats of WikiLeaks hack up Hillary Clinton and Jerry Miller account gives us a look into Clinton inner circle that filing onto a harboring story encourages the politicization and information in the frame of an allegation under the banner of transparency is partly responsible for, for, for the destruction of functioning democracy and tribalism creates domestic conflicts all of in 17. Try the trouble always leads to an into it and every voice that they cause goes a million dozen for one of their attorneys who key into an enabler as they can lend to in Britain and Spain they have Scotland, Catalan, and Sweden, a viable nation, Spain, and America to judge the one where one can do so much on minorities and the other is it disproportionately where, where both are growing in intensity as they would play their part of this is often under their framing because, because obviously if you're creating domestic conflict and genocide that is not promoting a uh, democracy and promoting uh, uh, and, and a tears of our community for thought. Reject one air theory. The one point is that the app gets two speeches uh, to go for the theory shell. A point is just psychology. They can always recontextualize the theory to be in the two area and beat me back which is a structural to you against a negative B point is that there is always going to be uncontested two AR offense that you can, that you can vote affirmative on. I cannot make new arguments in a three NR because I don't have one meaning that they would always run two when he's times two. There's a six, seven times two on the shell against the negative, which is a structural two against the negative. Careful for granted that is the third. It encourages the one, the one air, the two NR, the two air to uh, collapse the theory, which is better substance of education, substance of education always because it's a piece we can apply to the real world, whereas debating about, uh, debating about uh, like uh, competing in terms doesn't apply to the real world on case. Hijack to their framing. You say ethics starts with an obligation to the other contest of best isolation in this because agents have an obligation to not violate other agents' freedom and another hijack on exclusion is inevitable. We can prevent it instances of perfect duty and uphold everyone's freedom. Meaning we solve this impact on our framing should come first and uh, on their framing. The only way we, uh, we know if a democracy is effective is if it has a good consequence. There is nothing in terms of the prescribed, prescribed actions in their framing. One point induction fails induction assumes that things will always happen in the same way in the future as they happen in the past. But this begs the question how we know what happened in the past will happen in the future. Thus, induction is logically fallacious. Two point prediction is impossible. Any action can lead to a a domino effect that can have disasters, disasters, and vaccine. For example, if I sneeze, I can equally do a butterfly effect that eventually other Macy's deformed into a hurricane and kill thousands on ethics such as an obligation to the other one. But I do not deny that ethics is an inner subject to guide my framework. That's the way I'm going to be a separate civil obligation. I'm going to be agents of those who respect their ability to set set. I'm going to be one of those who only use in mind. We want to recognize their gut. So we can access our intuition, which means only my framework provides the explanatory power on why we care about your framework on differentiation is impossible. One, much of the thing is grounded in an operator that applies to everyone's even if it excludes a material truth that does not exclude agents that is taken out of your framework because it's only valid when all channels. We do the art through social interaction, not the move evidence that says this is the correct ethical theory of this premise true. Then antagonism is inevitable since everything is a solution. One can never have an antagonist in a relationship with another since there is a way to reconcile the difference between agents on the five reasons, one point on the double one, the operator to self determine what's good and bad in the first place on circular arguing presume, uh, argumentation presumes agency and freedom means that we are free requisite to the ability to argue against a framework on the contingent nature argument. A point operator reason means contingent nature doesn't exist and be one doesn't matter that it is contingent because the uh, reason exists operator is a prerequisite in any action on the value of life argument that life is valuable, uh, valuable because the interaction we have to uh, protect or her freedom are free is key to understand why. Interaction have any impact on us on the all exclusion argument that categorical imperatives also we determine whether or not you should take an action through whether or not it violates a categorical imperative on the on a counter a counter term caused by all of the all of the no RBI's justification. This outweighs this outweighs all of their arguments because they can literally stand up and redefine the theory to be in the two which they gets rid of any ability for the negative to win on the show. Okay, uh, so what are so what arguments were not right? Um cut the stuff like under view down. Okay, um, so do you uh, did you you read the first one, but you didn't read anything after that, correct? Um, so you read cross apply no RBIs, but you didn't read anything else. Yeah, okay. and then we'll on tribalism, I didn't read the Chua card, and then the two through four offense on the NC, I didn't read, and then also the. Wait, wait, sorry. Can you go back to tribalism? What did you? What did the you Chua card. The. Ch the first card. Oh, okay. Do you just want me to send a new doc? Yeah, okay. that's, that's easier. Yeah. Do you want me to send it before or after? Uh... Um, how about before? Because like the, my questions are pretty relevant to the stuff. Okay, it's saved anyway. All right, it's. Let me just close it. Uh, some of this stuff is just crossed out. So okay, makes sense. Um, 
perceive that you have multiple lines of data. In the Judge psychology matters. What, like, why do, you, why does judge psychology matter? Yeah. So, like, you get to stand up and give the last speech and like say exactly like what the judge wants to hear and say like the right arguments that are persuasive. Okay. Why can't you also do that in two in our considering that you have a six minute two in order to contextualize more as well? I yeah. So the argument is you get to speak last. You get to speak after I do. You get to leave okay. a lasting impression on the judge's decision. Yes. Because okay, that has one. Thing. That's cool. Um, let's go on to the. Um, you say uncontested two-way or offense. What's the word? Like, or like, why? What? How yeah, is so the, the, how is the app able to make new arguments in the two-way or? Yeah. So on a one-way or theory cell, like A judges are usually pretty lenient when evaluating on like what arguments you can make in the two-way or B. Like the two-way or gets to do new weighing between arguments, which will always mean that the affirmative can just win on the shell because you okay, can always get new weighing. Okay, I get new weighing. Okay, cool. That makes sense. Uh, you say time skew because there's a six, seven time skew on the shell. Why can't you leverage things like T? And like coming up the NC means that you get a 13 7 times skew. I, what do you mean? By that? You say 6 7 times skew on the shell. Why can't you, can you leverage T offense against the shell? Like semantics comes first or something like that. That's just a reason as to why like other arguments interact with the shell. That's not a reason why you should get one AR theory. Okay, cool. Uh, let's go to the cons NC. Uh, you say that violations of privacy are a contradiction in conception. Yeah. Why is that? Uh, why, why is like me saying that someone has to disclose their information necessarily mean that I just don't see them as a human being anymore? Yeah, so the argument is that like, if you, you cannot conceive of a world in which you force someone else to disclose their information and disclose like their autonomy and like basically like give up their autonomy to consent to like what you are telling them to do when okay. you can also so it's will that max. It's, it's an autonomy impact? That's one of the warrants, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, let's go on to the intro. Yeah. Uh, you say sh 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 topic education. Why is topic education important, uh, considering that you didn't actually read the education voter? Um, I'd say that's a prereq to like you reading an education book. I see. Okay. Um, you s okay. Cool. Uh, okay. Uh, is is research burdens an impact for fairness or education? Uh, research burden. Because it just seems to say that research burdens are drawn well, which means that we both have like reciprocal arguments so that we can both gain the same amount of education. No, the, the argument is that when you spec these two types of information, you could like literally just spec this and like infinitely prep your app, whereas I have to prep like a ton of different permutations of app, a, like an infinite number of combinations of a, okay, like a cool. candidacy yeah. and a Un type of baiting? info. Why does us baiting theory cause infinite abuse? Where? Sorry. You say baiting, don't just bait theory and prep it out just because it's infinite abuse? Why does baiting theory just by infinite abuse? Yeah, so you could literally read whatever you want, and as long as you stand up and you read your pre-written counterinterp for three minutes. How you is that to, infinite abuse? Because you have the ability to literally read whatever you want and like have infinite abuse if you have a pre-written counterinterp and get an RBI on the channel. That does not make sense, but okay, uh, starting prep now. Does, do impacts, do consequences matter under Kant? No. Okay, cool. Wait, what do you, like, what? Yes, you say Kant, and then you say tribalism causes consequences. I'm asking, does, do consequences matter under Kant? Oh, the dissent is offense under your favor. Okay, cool. That's why That's I read good. it.
125 one, we're just going to be uh, new off caught, and then uh, the, or sorry, new off t caught. Uh, let me send out the dog. Uh, do you want me to send you the intro too? Yeah, sure. Okay, let me just put that one too. Perhaps right off the intro. Uh, oh, it's at intros at the bottom of the dock. Sorry, it'll actually like be at the top, like the intro, but it's at the bottom of the dock. Sorry, that's how we Uh, we're going to be new off and then cut. Right, and, uh, the interp huh? is at the bottom of the dock. Oh. Yeah. Looks <laughs> like size eight. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I can't read. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> <X> <laughs> Wait, oh, really? That's the same size as the minimized card font? Yeah, it's because that's the default font I have in the library. Yeah, exactly. I could. Can you, you should fix that. Do you, want, do you want me to? You're fine, it? I can read it. Okay. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> that's not eight. That's, that's I think it's six, six, actually. I think it's six. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. I'm fucking <laughs> wrong. <laughs> Sorry, Harvey. I tried to read it. <laughs> Interpretation then we must not read the show that deny after the RBI turns on the AC and deny the F1 air theory. The, 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 the standard is stress cube whenever they, they can go for straight right thing, the F which causes seven to o, which causes seven to six times you and also the F has to go for the F has to go for parent under review, which means that the F which causes seven to be because the F was functionally was three minutes, three minutes of often because you can just try you can just straight right the F for you can just straight right the F for for a long time. Also also uh, also the, the also the unique office coming off the uh, denying F and RBI and turns and then uh, denying the F one air theory means that there's no possibility for me to check that because they can just be they can just be infinitely be so like read 20 million, uh, 20 million names, and there's no theory recourse for the affirm, which uh, there's no theory recourse for the affirm, and crossify their voters uh, on top county. First, uh, Ca uh, counter interpretation, commerce of the interpretation, the, uh, the, the, the uh, standards, uh, vi violation, I mean, standards, the standard is standard overloading, whatever, uh, uh, the standards overloading, whatever, the applicant spec, that means that there's only one single applicant, if infinite, if next, which straight turns limits, this also outweighs zero, so limits are made because the app doesn't ever, the app never have substantive, the, 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 the negative can always just read JRX, but the app has a substantive response to every single condensation that negative bring, brings up the second standards, picks with the picks, whole res, whole res, happens, and the because it means that every single one that's in the world, the necessary, we expect this curve to speak, because less than the, 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 the specification. 
Shift out. Shift out. Shift Shift out. Of, no, no, only thing is it picks more easily. Next, on their stairs, they say limits because it's spec laws for millions of different permutations of different positions. A point impact on its limits are limits is good. It's good because it's for generics, which creates multi methodology contestation. Next, next picks turn picks for picks are worse because there's no after generic recourse when the math doesn't have short. They say topic education, but there's no education or or which means that it doesn't matter. They say rust for us, but you can just frontline generics and stuff, which solves all the offense. So you also get the frontline generics for four years. Why only get the frontline the half two months? Next, say RBI will be theory in private now, but no, you will the the one year is the one is going. The one year is really hard going through the RBI and for something because it means that because it means that one year has to mess up extra time. Second, at least some trials are just true, which means that there is no possibility of different abuse. Second, third, there's literally too many there's too many there's literally too many shells that we have to probably cross apply their own limits argument that indicates that indicates that whenever we have too many shells, there's no possibility of us prepping all of them out. Um, next they say that next they say RBI is logical, but the argument is not that you should vote for me because I'm topical. The argument is that you should vote for me because your interpretation is bad, which is a, which is logically continuous statement. Now, also, there's no reason that logic there's no reason that logic is about. Uh, there's no reason to logic that insofar as you say that fairness <coughs> is considered a debate, which means that it comes first. On con. The omnivore was an extra, an extra blue to a publicity principle. Maxims cannot be one private. It also begs the question why one is willing them in the first place. That which implies that the action is on just two warrants. Con I five for gender language. Publicity must be owned to every legal title. All actions relating to our rights of others are wrong in the maxims. They fall in consensus with publicity. There is something wrong in the maxims. I cannot diverge where I cannot publicly acknowledge without starting off opposition. This resistance can be due to the other cause that are addressed with, uh, with which such a maxim threatens everyone. Serves only by means by which means no action is addressed. Next, why he fails to treat the receiver with a lie and then themselves. Of course, are one. Conditional under law autonomy is violated as when lies are used. Conditional under which you decide for yourself that you have power over Knowledge is what or was going on the lies on the country's condition, so question was fundamental wrongdoing. Next, omitting information relevant to a decision that foreign lying. Mahan, um, I don't know. It is impossible to see by an omission. One may allow a person to acquire possibility for a lot of person to continue with without, without true value. One may allow deception by omission. Further, even an absent lying information, but they believe with an intent of getting someone to make a choice against their will feels to treat them as an end in themselves. The requires are two. To respect the autonomy to treat or someone whose beliefs are controlled by her own reasons to decide whether you must not return to believe what you think he bet she has a right to decide. Uh, cut the course of our three on, uh, offense on to the entrepreneur. Uh, or on this line by line on the con. Uh, you uh, you say that so you claim that there yeah, you claim that certain scenarios are arbitrary. There's no actual impact to arbitrariness. You know, also, you say it's not to the ultimate out of voting someone's offense, but that's not, that's not often that's not often either. Also, our arguments that way because our public prints out of ways because if you're allowed to keep things private, then you can violate infinite maxims. While you are while you only violate one maxim by revealing privacy. Next on the affirmative. Uh, next on the affirmative. On review. Uh, on, under, uh, on the under review, you have can, you you, uh, you can see the app flex scenario that negative has abilities when the eye winners to the app means same ability to two AR. You also can see that the, the only the negative reads T because only the app has a first skew hopper with us the app needs to already have to compensate for the next unique avenue to the value. This outweighs because of the structural skew which is where this is verifiable or their arguments for why there are uh, RBIs are only substantive arguments. Uh yeah, that's it. Three oh two. Every single card but the last one. What? Oh, you, wait, are you talking about what was sent in the wedding yards off or what? Never mind, never mind, that's fine.
the order. The order will be <coughs> the fourth off, the one air shelf, T. Uh, fourth off, one air shelf, this is T. Cool. cool. Everybody ready? No, no dog. No. <coughs> Everybody good? Extend the, extend the argument or reject one air theory, the, 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 the first point that the, the affirmative gets two species that, and the B point under that, that there will always be uncontested two air off, two air off, and say, they, they can see the weighing here, that this comes before everything else, because, uh, I, uh, because, uh, because, yeah, because you can always check back my abyss and react to the shell, but, uh, but I literally cannot, I, 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 can, I do not have a three, I do not have a three in order to be able to respond to the shell when they do new, new weighing in the two air. If you hear any new weighing or any new arguments as to why you should vote on the shell in the two air, this is just a legitimate, legitimate theory abyss. You should, you should evaluate this argument as a take out to their new off. And, uh, now on the new off. They've considered to the to, uh, they've they've considered the, the weighing on the on the new two AR uh, on the new, new two AR weighing and the, the which always because there is no way for me to answer this which means that you should reject the shell now uh, counterinterpretation the negative may read a shell that denies the app, the affirmative the REI and deny the app one air theory of the affirmative justifies both of the, uh, the the affirmative justifies access to both of these and their underview this solves all of the uh, all of the often because you literally justify getting access to both of these in the underview and you just cross apply the paradigms this means that the, uh, that the underview checks back on all of the abuse because you, because you have the ability to just cross apply arguments from the app the net benefit is critical thing you. Have to think on your feet and, and learn how to allocate your time. The critical thing is uh, the critical thing is good for uh, good for parents because uh, our bigger schools are always going to have more prep. But when we force them to think on their feet, we force them to actual to make actual arguments in round, which means that this is good for parents. Now on the interpretation, I meet. I didn't read turns on case. You can check the doc. I read a dissent and a contency and a t shell. If you can find a single turn on case, then maybe I, maybe I don't meet the interpret. There were literally no turns on case. Meaning I meet the meet the interpretation. Prefer text. Uh, prefer prefer text over spirit because spirit is not verifiable. You could just shift the interpretation. And I mean, so that, so that I don't meet the shell in your next speech, and, and, we, and uh, also, uh, spirit is not verifiable. Uh, spirit is not verifiable. Meaning, uh, yeah, I just need that argument. Uh, on the, on their trash argument, uh, this is not unique. You can, the affirmative can go for a, a lot of arguments as well. I, you can go, you can go for one or two. You can go for offense. You can go for offense on the content. You can go for, uh, you can go for an impact turn to the dissent. You could go for extensions of the underview. You could go for an a priori from the app. All of these arguments are things that you could have gone for. Meaning, meaning that the affirmative has many reasons to ballot as well. Uh, on, yeah, we meet the shell. Counterinterpret solves on T. Extend the interpretation. The affirmative debater must not read an advocacy the parametric sizes of the revolution. To, uh, the resolution. To clarify, the affirmative debater must not specify which candidates for public office the plan affects and deals with, and the type of information that the app would disclose. You can extend the violation. They literally uh, they, they, uh, check, the, uh, check the plan text of the affirmative day. They, spec, uh, they spec judicial candidates by uh, political affiliation. We're, uh, we're gonna, uh, you can extend the limit center. The specifying candidates allows for millions of permutations of app. I.e., you could use literally any different. Uh, you could use any different government position and combine it with any small piece of information. Meaning that I would never be able to. to you say uh, you uh, you make an impact term, but this is just a cross application of their picks argument from their standard, which we will argue, which we will which we will answer on the standard. You can you can extend uh, you can extend you can extend the reciprocity. Uh, you can uh, you can extend the fairness impact that this pigeonholes the negative into generic every. Uh, Oh, no, no, no. We're gonna. You can extend the C point, the, the C impact, the C point, the, the reciprocity. Their interpret requires the negative bifurcate the prep between an infinite number of apps. Where the one, whereas the one and C can always, uh, the one and C can always uh, destroy the one and C with a ton of front lines because they had infinite preps in the front line. There, they say front lining generic solves all of the options. However, the argument, the argument is that you can uh, the, uh, the A point, uh, A point. This doesn't solve. You can also front line generics, meaning uh, you can also write responses to, gen to generics, meaning that even if I front line generics, you can still write responses that take out my front line to the generics. And B point, it's a question of. I'm setting you justify reading an affirmative that I have literally no links to except things that you already have prepped out. Meaning, meaning that this is, this is terrible for your and as I see you against a negative this. Uh, the impact of this is research burden, so that both debaters have equal access to the ballot and have equal ability to do uh, to, to do prep. You can extend fairness as the voter debated a commitment of activity that requires objective evaluation and outweighs other voters on irreversibility in which we always get IE education from other rounds, but we will never get a level playing field without theory. You can extend drop the debater. The abuse of the, has already heard in my time allocation has shifted. Also, the shell and the affirmative the whole affirmative justifies severance, which excuse my shot. You can extend competing interests, uh, which leads to a race to the top for the best possible norm. You can extend no RBIs. We're gonna go for the baiting justification. The Dell just bait theory prep it out and they will always be able to win the round because it justifies infinite abuse. They could literally do whatever they wanted in the in, in, in the one AC as long as they had a pre-written counter, which means the negative would always lose the round. They said the one AR cannot go for everything, and there's no possibility to check back. However, our argument is that you can just go for theory. You can just prep out my interpretation and go for the for a route to the ballot that I'm trying to win. And also. Uh, 
it's, uh, it's not a question of whether or not you can go for everything. It's a question of, uh, of, uh, of whether or not you have you have a better ability to go for the shell than I do because you can literally just rewrite your counterinterpretation. This is uh, this is literally this is literally literally empirically proven. They wrote a pre-written counterinterpretation to the shell. They say there are too many shells to check back on. How are you literally list common shells that you can prep out? Also, you had a pre-written counterinterpretation which proves that you can prep out some shells. You can extend baiting outweighs this outweighs because uh, outweighs everything else because nobody would read theory in the world of the affirmative because uh, in the world of the RBI because uh, because we would never be able to win on the shell and the affirmative would bait it every time on the counterinterpretation on the counterinterpretation the converse of the interpretation this is incoherent there is no uh, the converse of the interpretation would necessarily transferring out the nouns and the verbs in the, in the sense of which is not a logical statement so you cannot vote on this counterinterpretation because it is incoherent they say that there would only be only one app however there can be multiple different advantages on the app so all you have to do is write a specific advantage and tell me why that always which means that which means that you, uh, even if there is only one app I still have multiple uh, there, I, I uh, you still can get specific price. You say this always limits it, and they can always read generics. However, the app can read generics as well, and the app can provide our generics uh, by running answer to our generic. Cross apply that argument from earlier. They say picks, however, they, all you have to a, a point, you just have to, give, have to give reasons why the affirmative is better than the pick. It's not that hard to make arguments at B point. Just give link differential arguments. That's why there's no reason why uh, why changing the affirmative one tiny bit is better than doing the affirmative. You can just give link differential arguments that, uh, that prove you can answer picks. Uh, Baiting outweighs every other argument for why they should get an RBI. We meet the 1AR shell. They don't get an RBI. Counterinterp does not make any sense. It's a question of the abuse story because they have conceded competing interpretations. If we win an abuse story, vote negative on the shell because they do not have a competing interp that is going here. Cool. Uh, starting breath. What's the uh, argument for spirit over text? Uh, spirit is non-verifiable. Uh, we can never like verify what you actually meant by your spirit. Uh, the the implication of this is that you can like literally just shift the interpretation in your next speech so that I never meet the inter. Uh, which is probably a bad bad for friends. Don't matter. Even if the, even if I don't get RBI, I'm winning, I'm winning on substance. Since they, they can see the contours, they send the contour privacy. Uh, pri pri privacy is bound on uh, privacy is bound on con. So even if I don't get RBI, I win the show. I win on uh, on T. Yeah, you said uh, extend the counter interpretation. Converse of the interpretation. You're arguing on converse of the interpretation. That converse of the interpretation makes no sense. But no, yeah, I believe you should have gone to in our books like this because I only have three minutes of response. Secondly, this, there is a converse of the interpretation. You just say I can't do something. Converse that is clearly that I can do something. Uh, converse that is clearly that I can do something. Which is that a converse of the interpretation exists. A uh, converse of the interpretation exists. They, you know, don't, uh, don't, don't cross my spirit of the interpretation of this because the argument literally makes no sense in the first place. Next, you say that next you say that I can get specific advantages in that. But the argument is that you're still able to link all of your generic. You're still able to link all of your generic. That you're out for four years against my app that I only had to prep for two months, which means that uh, uh, two, two months, which means that you don't get specific advantages. It's a question of what you can link to the from next. You say that yeah, always once, but uh, you say well, I always once because Afghan always oh, also read generics, but no, Afghan not read uh, Afghan. Uh, uh, um. Actually, no. Uh, you say uh, you say they say picks because we give a reason for why the app is hard. Uh, yeah, but no. First, picks are really hard to respond to because I have to basically return on them. And when they are in, you can just kick them out through conditional. Secondly, uh, as, as, uh, if they're conditional. Secondly, they're, uh, this is uh, this is just defense on picks. You don't actually have reasons why picks is good, which means that this is so often sort of the counter interpretation. Next, they say, uh, uh, next you can see that there's no sort of substantive recourse against picks. If I don't have ability to respond to it, while you get respond, you give a ability to respond to things with generics like a contency, which was empirically proven by the contency that you ran in this round. Which means that even if, even if the picks running is that they make it through your abuse outweighs. So uh, on the counter uh, on their interproper 
for a counter interpreter. Extend the over limiting standard, which was conceived, which means that there is only one affirmative uh, against infinite different negative positions. We've already addressed the response to this. Uh, we've already addressed the response to this. You also can see that these, uh, the, the form of AF over limiting that they have done, uh, the form of AF over limiting that they have done is much, wor uh, much, worse because, uh, much worse because of the other argument. Next, you say extend, uh, extend uh, the limit standard because there are millions of permutations of AFs, but you've conceded that limits, to, uh, you've conceded a point that limits don't matter. Because, uh, you limits don't matter because you're still able to prep out your generics, which means that you're still able to get it. You also can see the impact on limits that, generic, that you, being, you, you being forced to read generics is good. Be both A point because it's more fair for you because you get to prep them out, B point because it means that we, it means that we can have more multi methodology discussion, which uh, multi methodology discussion, as you say, impact on this is across cross talk from things. Uh, that, that there was the limitation on that. You say you have, you have to bifurcate prep because the can always destroy the YC with a ton of front lines. You can really clearly apply the generics argument here because it, 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 you, uh, and you can see the weighing on the generics argument, which indicates that you get four years. That's always going to be outweighed by two months. Your only argument on this is that it doesn't solve because I can read things that you don't link to. But yeah, but but but, think, but the argument is that like every single app has to either like defend some sort of state action or some sort of non-state action. There are always bidirectional shells. There are always like bidirectional case, which means that you will always be able to read some sort of generic on a specific AC, which is better for you. It's uh, which is better for you, and it, uh, it also means that uh, it also means that the affirmative gets to specify, which means that we get to have better debates. It's very clear to vote. Uh, no, if their T offense matters, but even uh, if their T offense matters, and even if I uh, don't win the show, the cost turns, I guess. Yeah. Good round.
guess the counterinterpretation was just converse, right? Uh, yeah. yeah. I guess you can check Lawrence's recording if you like want to know for sure. Huh? That sounds like team report. I'm not. What did he say? He's like, you can just check the recording. I, I, I will probably never watch that recording. I, I want to say that I feel like I said something else, but I'm not sure. I think it's a counter uh, converse I can spec or something.
both of you are good round here. It's a very tough tournament. Uh, you guys did very well. It is a three over the negative. Um, I will start. I don't really care for this Converse stuff. I think it's too little. Side note, I think this whole Converse of the Revolution or the inter trend doesn't make sense anyhow. I think uh, inter and counter inters are equivalent to plans, counter plans, and Converse does not eat their counter plans. Right, there's a text element there that I think is important. Don't be lazy. Uh, it doesn't matter to me. Ultimately, I see this research burdens argument. It's called reciprocity, but it's research burdens getting extended in the one end and exceeded in the two A. I'm not seeing an explicit response anywhere. Uh, perhaps I missed it. I don't think so. I'm seeing some of this generic good slash bad on both sides, but. I really struggle to understand, number one, how to weigh this generics against this uh, prep burden thing. Number two, how to impact this generics thing at all. You're like, generics are good for focusing on, I, I, I genuinely barely know what the argument is. You get prep. It, it seems much more defensive by nature. It also seems, if the argument was made, it's not. But it's something that should have been made is that it's not unique. We both agree generics exist. It's just a question of the other offense in the round. So I, I, I think there's an issue here with uniqueness that just is an issue, uh, even though it doesn't become a decision calculus question. And the next is that any impact that I'm seeing seems more education-based and fairness at best. There's not an education voter. I'm not so much a stickler for this that it's like, oop, this is all gone. But when I do have an explicit fairness argument with a voter there and the impact isn't clear in any other speech, uh, it's really hard to give this generic stuff credence. The final thing I think I have to say is that you should have spent three minutes on picks bad and you didn't, in my opinion. Okay. Right, because it is genuine offense. You've got a fairness claim. It was fairly developed. And then you're just like, picks are hard. And then you right. basically move on. Right? And I thought that was a big, big, big like, mistake on your part. The other big mistake is so much time on RBI. Just, just, you lost like 10% of at least of the 1 AR to RBIs. I mean, that is worthless. So if that's not a lesson, uh, it should be. I, I, yeah, I just, I, I think. I don't have to look beyond the page. Okay. The waste of time on the RBI I think also applies to the negative. But yes. what more? Yes. Yes. So you waste yes. so what? much of the In what world no, no, that might ever be from that one? Wow. And all the more theory stuff, yeah. stuff, all the answers and everything. So much conceded on here, theory bad. You do have a genuine I need here that I think I buy. And like, you, make, you can make it so much easier on yourself. Yeah. Um, side note the converse stuff is like, Troll, well, I almost voted egg on it, but I decided not to. But it, it is correct because it's the switching of the subject and the predicate. So it's like, <coughs> af, like af may not do like why, and so the converse is just like why may not do af, which is nonsense, obviously. But whatever, I just, I agree with everything that Lucas said. Like the all the like generics good stuff, like I thought was implicated as an impact turn, but like what the, what the impact to it was was nothing more than defensive in my mind. Over limiting was like a good argument in the one AR, and literally just the words over limiting with no impact count for that either. Um, picks bad, as I agree with Lucas, like that's viable to AR. It's hard is not like a coherent argument against like yeah, two, two that, that, was anyway. that was just like you could just weigh your app against it and like make some responses. Um, not not saying that the two was perfect either. Like it's unclear as to like uh, you know how to resolve a lot of the impacts that Lucas mentioned. Like some of them seem to be floating, like leaning towards education, and some of them not. Like the way that you explicitly deal with like the generics good bad impact debate is is like a little bit muddled. And like the way that the overlimiting versus underlimiting debate gets played out, like should be in favor of the negative because the two hundred at least makes the push, which is like advantages solve their underlimiting claim, but uh, or sorry, solve their overlimiting claim, but underlimiting is uniquely bad for the neg. But like even those like sort of general core weighing issues, like or weighing arguments that helps figure out how to think about the impact versus the impact turn, don't even get developed, and that just leaves it way too much up to the judge to try to fill it in. Uh, but everything else in the so it's really very cool. Uh, I largely agree uh, with uh, with my esteemed colleagues. Um, it's maybe a little simpler for me. Um, I don't think the counterinterpretation makes sense. Uh, the converse. Like, thing. I don't think it's logic. No, you're not. You're not doing the converse. Like you, your counterinterpretation isn't the converse. It's like it's like it's like. And and that's literally all you say in the one AR, like. You know, so much that I had to think, oh, oh, is he saying the word converse? I am um, aware of those. And, yeah, yes, yes. Here, here, here's the star. That's Doc Martens. 
it, anyway, um, you know, and I, so I think the way, obviously the way you're explaining, like, like the functionality of the counterinterpretation, like, makes it take a little bit longer, but, um, you know, like the fact that the counterinterpretation is so short and it's not logical in the one AR, like, you know, the two in R is right. Um, as far as, like, you know, on the on the standards layer, um, I'm having I think the same problem that Lawrence is um, and and Lucas to some extent with like with the generics argument. Um, I don't know that I buy your argument in the two AR um, that the impact turn on generics means we can have like more discussion. I mean, depending on what's your idea of what constitutes a discussion, like, I don't know if it's more, like, I don't know if reading, like, you know, big topic generics for four years constitutes more discussions. Um, I think it certainly doesn't constitute better discussions. Um, and so, I mean, I'm probably, I'm probably airing neg, like, you know, like, does it make sense, like, you know, does it make sense to, uh, to set a norm? And like, you know, yeah, like if I'm hearing egg on the generics argument, then, yeah. then, then yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. You better find out. Good job, guys. Congrats. Why do you need this? This is my oh, time. Yeah. Yeah. Good job, Andrew. Yeah, thank you. Andrew, you're not starting. Andrew, Andrew.